Only on 10 News, businesses in Mission Valley are fed up with a growing problem in their backyard. They say the homeless are getting more bold and scaring customers. 10 News reporter Matt Mendez reveals the solution the city came up with that one businessman says is not good enough. For me, it disgusts me. Dan Weber is part owner of this Mission Valley Plaza building. This is called Hillside Review. In 20 and years, he's seen the homeless population grow. We've got an encampment which uh, generally has at least three or four individuals. They've set up camp along this hillside behind the office building, leaving behind trash. Tenants have taken these pictures, showing homeless people throughout the area. They say the homeless are getting out of control. I just can't be good any way around. One guy even snuck in and hid inside the women's restroom. They carry themselves in an aggressive manner. Others have broken lights in this parking garage and harassed tenants. There are no trespassing signs posted all over the property, but they still don't keep homeless people away. Weber has called and emailed the mayor, city council and police. Which outlined the problem here in Mission Valley. He says SDPD told him he has to evict the homeless who are illegally staying on his land. And he says Councilman Todd Gloria's office suggested Councilman hiring an Sherman's, outreach program. Because the city won't do their job. That one confused me a lot. 10 News talked to this man who was in the encampment but denies living there. I don't stay back here. Dog. I have no idea who, how many people stay here. I just know that they, you know, people stay all over. He weighed in on complaints against the homeless, blaming the businesses. And they had nothing to do but to pick on some guy or some... They're just bored. In Mission Valley. Every time you see a homeless person, give them 100 bucks. Matt Mendes, 10 News.